Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, yeah, so I've updated the links for the download section here, but uh, a few of you are saying that you can't get the clear data button to work. Now, obviously, I've just copied it to a new system now, so I will get the same error that you do. There's no problem. Now, we're using docs.google, so Google Sheets. So the way to get this to work is what you're going to do is go to extensions. Then you're going to go to apps script, okay? Once you go there, it's going to load up the script editor and just delete that out. And you're going to paste in this information. OK, I'll put this in the description. And what it's doing is function clear cells. Now, the important thing that you need to note is where it says here, Trinity step system, that has to match up with the sheet name. OK, so if you change the sheet name, this won't work. But what you can do is um, where well, you can just double click and then copy that out. And then you're going to paste that in this section here. It's already in there for me. And then the sheet range, this will be the range of the data that you want to clear. So in this case, I would select all of these like this. And I can see up in the top right corner, E8 to G32. So make sure it's just these uh, cells that are highlighted the yellow cells here. OK, and once you've got that, you're just going to copy that out. So G8 to G32, which is already set. Then what you're going to do is click Save. And then you're going to go back to your sheet. You're going to go to this button and then right click. Um, one second. So right click and then you're going to see the three dots here. You click there and then click on Assign Script and then you want that to match, uh, sorry, I've got things going on here. You want to, that to match this name here, which is clear cells. So you would copy that out and then you would just simply paste that in and then click OK. And then once you've done that, it should work. You might get, um, you might get a message saying that you need to trust the script, but um, let's have a look. So clear data. Yeah, a script attached to the doc needs a permission to run. So I click OK. And then what you need to do is sign into your account. And it says Google hasn't verified this app. Simply click on advanced. Um, uh, sorry. Back, uh, how, oh, yeah. Sorry. Scroll down a little bit. Go to un, untitled pro project. OK, so that's OK. And then you should be OK if you click allow. OK. And once that's done, it should work. There we go. So yeah, I mean, it's a little bit of a, a hassle, but once you've done that, then it is done. It's just that the app script was set for my account. And obviously once you download this sheet, it's not working because it's based on your Google account, not mine. So once that's uh, done, you are good to go. So I hope this uh, video has been helpful and uh, I will copy this data out. Just remember that you need to make sure that the uh, sheet name is there you need to make sure that this clear cells is the function that you're adding. Remember, you right click, you can see the three dots and then you can assign the script. And that's where that goes in there. And then the range which you want the data to be cleared is this section here, E8 to G32. Uh, but obviously, uh, if you're going to do this yourself, you might want to change those. Anyway, I hope that helps. Take care and I will speak to you soon.